kid who has been accepted to every college he applied to, including <laughs> all eight Ivy League schools, and now all he has to do is choose. Harold Eke is a senior at Elmont Memorial High School. He joins us live now. Congratulations. Thank you. For all the parents watching right now <laughs> whose kids want to go to a great college, how did you do it? I, I would say I like worked pretty hard. Um, I definitely tried to apply myself to, and try to take advantage of every opportunity that was afforded to me um, in, in my high school. And I, I'd say I'm, I'm pretty self-motivated. I try to, you know, reach out to like yeah. my teachers, and like I was very involved in school. So I think like th those are the like the so things. more than just doing your homework. Yeah, definitely more than doing your homework. You have to be very involved, like community service and um, you know, art artistic and things well, like that. Well, you 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 know all about opportunities. You came to this country from Nigeria at age eight. Yeah, eight years. And old. in the beginning. Could people understand what you were saying? No, not really. I spoke with a very like thick accent, and, and like I'd say it, it was difficult trying to like adapt right. to the new environment and absorb you know every everything the new culture. But uh, my parents set a very good example for me and my. And your parents brothers. were doctors or something like that? Uh, no, they were just like they worked at Target at first. When they, they were came. clerks at Target. Uh, yeah, they definitely struggled, you know, to like find stable jobs to support my family. So, so. now, as you apply to these Ivy schools and the acceptance start coming in, what are you thinking? I, I'm just like shocked. I'm, I, I was really stunned when I got the acceptances. I think like I'm very humbled by the entire situation because like um, I get to represent my school and community in such a positive light. Sure. I see this as, as an accomplishment, not not really for me, but for my community, for my school, and what and about everybody. It? And for your family too. You, and that's family. actually yeah. why you wanted to get into this, is yeah. your grandmother's Alzheimer's and you want to try to find a cure. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. That, that's, that led to my ultimate career goal of becoming a neurosurgeon. I read one of the stories about you and it said that what really blew away the admissions officers was your essay. Yeah. And you talked about coming to America. Yes, I did. Give us a little, give us the, the thumb note. Okay, so, so the main gist of the essay was about like coming to America and just, like kind of struggling to adapt to like the new environment. But um, seeing my, my parents lead by example and be being very tenacious and you know like no matter how many times it'd, it'd get knocked down they would always like you know keep going forward and, and persevere despite the potential to like s succumb to the c circumstances and that's something that I really appreciated with my parents and so I took their example and I started talking to the people like in, in on the playground you know I went to the playground I started speaking to them and I tried to apply myself to the new environment and try to really so, absorb so it's interesting instead of letting me wonder if they're gonna accept me you yeah. want to put yourself out there exactly. and say I dare you not to exactly. accept me yeah. almost yeah. Yeah. so here exactly. it is now they're also so you're on the cover of Newsday over the weekend. This <laughs> yeah, is like the second, it's incredible. That, that now, crazy. they even got word back in Nigeria about your success. What's the reaction yeah. been? Uh, they're very, very excited. Like, my, my grandmother called me and she's like so excited. Um, she's like ecstatic. So, yeah. we're okay, you want, are you ready this morning to announce where you're going to go? Harvard, oh, Yale, Princeton, Brown, Columbia, <laughs> Cornell, or Dartmouth. Which one is it? I'm not sure yet. Or well, the University of Pennsylvania. You're leaning towards Yale. He doesn't want to let everyone I'm, down. I'm leaning towards Yale right now because I competed at Yale last year um, with, at the Model United Nations Conference. And we actually won the best small delegation. And when you world, grow up, what do you want to do? Yeah, I like to become a neurosurgeon when I grow up. That's right. ultimate goal. Ladies uh, and gentlemen, hopefully what you do find a cure <laughs> for Alzheimer's too. Yeah, I'll try my best. Thank yeah. you. Uh, just don't forget about us, right? Yeah, of course not. Good All luck to right, you, Harold. Thank Good you luck. So much. And let us Thank know your decision. You. We'd like you to come back after you announce and tell us what went into it. Okay, All right? sure. Great. All right. Thank All right. You. Let the recruiting begin. Harold, good job. Thank you. All right.